All right, thanks for stopping by. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to use a Windows tweak tool to make adjustments for Windows. And this tweak tool is offered by the Windows Club. And there's a version for Windows 10, version 7, and Vista and 8. Not that anybody even runs Vista anymore. The link will be down in the description for you to just click on and go. But once you get to the page, you just simply scroll down until you see a blue button that says Download Ultimate Windows Tweaker. Go ahead and click on that. It'll start the download. And then once the download comes down, it's going to be a zip file, so you'll need to unzip that. I use 7-Zip. It's a great program. Once it's, un once it's unzipped, you'll see these five files. Now, or these four files, excuse me. There's nothing to install. You just double click on the Ultimate Windows Tweaker and that's going to pop this program up here. It's going to look like this and it'll give you the overview of your system and it always takes a snapshot, a system restore point, before it ever loads up to ensure you that anything that you tweak can always be undone. So if you click on Customize, now I'm not going to get into all the bells, buttons, and whistles. You just need to get in here, take a look at this, make alterations to the taskbar, your file explorer, your PC, your user account, performance. Just go in here and start playing with it. You're not going to hurt anything. And if all else fails, down at the bottom, just click on Restore Defaults. And if you want to create a restore point before you even commit to any of these changes, Whatever tab you're on, down at the bottom, you'll always see Create Restore Point. So you can create the restore point and try it, reboot the machine, check it out, or hit Restore Defaults if it doesn't work out. But this will help speed up your machine and give you much better performance in Windows. So it's just a quick video. So if you liked this, go ahead and subscribe and like and pass it around, tell people, and I'll make some more videos. Thanks for stopping by.